Hey guys, so I thought I would just show you today what I'm gonna eat on my uh, weight loss vegetarian meal plan. I've been trying to go into a calorie deficit where I can on those days where I don't have events or I don't have um, friends over or going out for meals. And so I've been just trying to find like really nice vegetarian meals um, to add into my diet because I've tried to take a little bit step back of meat. I'm not fully vegetarian at all. I still do eat meat, but I just try and eat more vegetarian than not. And I've been trying to lose a bit of weight. My goal weight is eight stone six. I'm currently eight stone 11. So I've got like, like five pounds I want to lose. I'm doing running and I'm eating healthy and I'm doing some Pilates and stuff, but I thought I would just share with you today like a day in the life of me on my kind of weight loss plan at the moment and trying to be healthy. So at the start of the day, I decided to get a nice early walk in with my husband. We went and got some coffee from the um, from our, my favorite coffee shop in Bristol, which is um, coffee number one because the coffee in coffee number one I think is the best coffee. I love their cappuccinos, they get a nice frothy cappuccino. And the other thing I wanna say is that when you're on a weight loss diet, if you're doing the calorie deficit, you don't have to cut out like delicious foods. So for breakfast this morning, I had a pan of raisin and I love pastry. Pastry is one of my favorite things in the whole world. So I am not gonna let this diet stop me from having foods that I like. I just want to balance it out. So I'm going to have a nice salad and a really healthy vegetarian soup for dinner. And, um, you know, it's balancing out the pano raisin that I had this morning, but I don't feel any guilt about it whatsoever. And, um, you know, you just live your life and, you know, do what you can. So I thought I would just share with you today a day in the life. So uh, yeah, if you want to see uh, what I'm eating, then yeah, please do keep watching and I will check in with you later. I just love to see all of this fresh ingredients. I feel like I'm just gonna be living my best healthy life. Hey guys, I've got my eye patches on. I thought I'd do a little um, skincare while I talk you through what I got from the supermarket. So I'm gonna be making two meals today for my healthy veggie weight loss. Um, so the first meal that I'm going to make is a buffalo chicken salad, which is amazing, but it's made with corn. And then for dinner, I'm going to make a red Thai curry soup with vegetables. So I'm going to run through all the ingredients that I got. And, um, I'm just so, I love seeing all like fresh produce. So I got coconut milk for the curry. I got Caesar dressing, light Caesar dressing for the salad, some green olives for the salad, some pickled. I like looking into the like the ethnic aisle because I love looking at things and finding stuff like this. It's often cheaper in the ethnic aisle as well, like the Asian or the like different like countries. So this is pickled chili peppers in vinegar. I love stuff like that to add to a salad. Coriander for my curry soup. Organic cucumber because I listened to this podcast with Gillian Michaels and Melissa Gorga and Gillian Michaels was saying how much we should try and have organic food where we can because it's got all the pesticides um, not sprayed on it. And there's something called the lean, wait, what's it called? The, the Dirty Dozen and the Clean 15. And the Dirty Dozen are like fruits and vegetables that basically if they're sprayed, it's like penetrates inside of the vegetable or fruit really easily because the skin is thin. And then the Clean 15 are like thick skinned fruits and vegetables where pesticides cannot penetrate inside. So they're not so bad if you don't buy it organic. But something like a cucumber, definitely would be thin skin. So I'm trying to do a bit more organic where I, where I can. Um, then I've just got some sweet corn for my salad. 
Um, I've got a pepper for my salad and I'm going to use that in the soup as well. Lime for the soup, garlic for the soup, um, some blue cheese for my salad because I'm doing a blue cheese buffalo chicken salad, courgette for my soup, red curry paste for my soup, some spring onions for the soup, an organic lettuce for my salad, rice noodles for my soup, um, the Frank's buffalo sauce, it's my favourite, we both love it, like Sam really got me into buffalo sauce because he used to live in America and he used to have like buffalo chicken pizza and it was like his favourite thing. And then I got mozzarella and pesto corn scallops which are for my salad, I'm obsessed. And then I just picked up this um, ramen noodle like thing and I thought that would be just quite good um, to have in the week. So that's everything from my grocery haul and um yeah i'm gonna do like some bits around the house today let you guys see what i'm gonna eat she says she the one i bet she thinks she is stand on high no trust i don't know where you been I need a break, on the brakes, I'm on a wave, like Lake Michigan, cold, she the one, man she thinks she is, sand on high, no trust, I don't know where you been, I need a break, on the brakes, I'm on a wave, like Lake Michigan. Hey guys, so I'm back in the kitchen, and this time, I'm actually here to clean my makeup brushes, so my makeup brushes are totally just in need of a deep clean and my beauty blender as well and then i'm gonna clean them in the sink here with my um fairy liquid and i'm gonna my tap gets quite hot so i've got my rubber gloves and i am gonna get my little uh brush washer washer thingy and i'm just gonna watch some real housewives so it's gonna be a good little um, 15 minutes. But what I'm gonna try and do today is just, you know those jobs that you know, you, you've had on your to-do list? This is one of them. And also I wanna clean the downstairs shower. <laughs> so very exciting. Um, but stuff that has to be done and I know I'll feel better on Monday if I do it. I can tell you nothing feels more amazing than when you've cleaned your makeup brushes. They just feel, it just feels like you're on top of your life. <laughs> okay, now I'm coming at you from the bathroom <laughs> because I am gonna clean the bathroom um, little cubby thing. And um, it's just nice to keep on top of it because you don't want all that kind of stuff to build up. So I just take all the products out and just give it a little kind of brush down with a, a toothbrush and yeah. Okay, so it is lunchtime and I'm gonna start preparing my uh, buffalo chicken salad. And I've got these corn chicken escallops that I put in the oven because I love them so much. Um, and they are mozzarella and pesto and so I make the salad and then I layer over the chicken um, So I'm just going to start chopping up all of my um, Vegetables so I've got like literally oh I just ate some crisps as well. I ate these um, cheese and onion crisps um, Because I was hungry Anyway, so I've got cucumber, red onion, some blue cheese, I've got a orange pepper, I've got sweet corn, I've got olives, jalapenos, uh, chili peppers, Caesar dressing, and lettuce. So I'm gonna wash everything that needs to be washed and start preparing my salad.
Okay, this is a really random tip, but if you want to get your lettuce nice and small, I literally just get scissors and I just go in with scissors and just chop, chop, chop. And it makes your lettuce go nice and small so it's nice and bite sized. And you don't have like a giant piece of lettuce that you're trying to like get in your mouth. It's very nice little tiny pieces. So this is the final salad. It's so good. So you've got the chicken, you've got the blue cheese, the buffalo sauce, and it's just really healthy and yummy. It's now the evening and I'm going to make a delicious dinner, low calorie, um, red Thai curry vegetable soup. So I've been chopping my vegetables. So I've got my garlic, I've got pepper, I've got red onion, I've got courgettes, and I've, I'm gonna add like rice noodles, a lime, the red paste, red Thai curry paste, coriander, and then the spring onions and the ginger. So I'm really excited. I've actually never ever tried, please excuse my dressing gown. <laughs> I've actually not tried yet this, um, recipe before so I'm really excited um, I think it's just gonna be a nice like healthy vegetable but with like lots of flavor and just nice and quick and easy so that's what I'm gonna make now for dinner Okay, so here is my finished soup. I'm really happy with it actually. Um, try and show you in better lighting. Yeah, so it looks absolutely delicious. Filled with vegetables and noodles and lots of flavor and yeah, my hand's shaking. <laughs> Heavy plate. Anyway, bon appetit. She said she don't want, I bet she thinks she is.